And here we have a 1981 C3 Corvette. Very nice condition. Silver with red interior. I think uh, the ad says 40,000 miles. Very nice, nice shape. It's a four speed car. And uh, yeah, it looks really great. Let's see the, uh, the info sheet. My gosh, it keeps on pouring here. 81, numbers matching, four speed, all paperwork, 40,190. For sale, uh, 26,900 OBO, 386-451-2277. Beautiful car. And here we have a 1968 Corvette Roadster. It's a four-speed car. Someone added side pipes to it. Obviously, it's had a pretty rough life but it is a uh, convertible and um, other than a ton of wow this is pretty thick actually <laughs> repairs and stuff it's uh, anything can be fixed so anyway interesting and here we have a 1974 stingray it is a four-speed car and it is in pretty pretty good condition here's the number if anybody's interested 352-209-4800 uh, the owner is dave i i just talked to him it is a four-speed car and it's, it's got side pipes and a molded uh, newer style bumper with the four brake lights. Again, it's a 1974 Corvette. So here we have a 1981 automatic. And uh, it's got uh, these side skirts. Uh, it looks pretty decent but it's got a little couple modifications nothing big deal 73,000 miles uh, red interior and uh, there's no price listed unfortunately but here's the uh, the info in case someone is interested 703-400-6640 uh, 73,000 miles consider uh, it'll consider a trade everything works according to the ad yeah this is all you get sometimes when it's pouring rain it's supposed to let up but uh, doesn't seem to be going in that direction weather wise really windy wet and a little bit cold so oh well I keep walking around see if I can find any other C3s before I catch some cold or pneumonia oh, oh here we go back in a minute oh check this out this is a 1981 two-tone um, Corvette and uh, what I found interesting is, uh, according to the info sheet here, it says that it was owned by John Cougar Mellencamp, and it was used in the Jack and Diane video. 30,000 miles, powder-coated frame out of a private collection. Interesting. 245-386-451-2277. And it looks pretty, pretty darn nice. So... Uh, history is correct could be an interesting purchase for someone and it continues to get windier and windier here in Daytona Beach at the Speedway and pretty cold to boot so I'm not having a lot of fun I am pretty wet my shoes are soaking wet my jeans are wet 
sometimes it happens not a lot of people of course because of this weather but oh well what are you gonna do you know you gotta roll with the punches I'm gonna go find some some coffee or something because I am pretty cold and it continues to rain here in Daytona Beach unfortunately here we have a car that I think I've filmed before uh, back in November 1971 for $29,995 it's automatic it's got the uh, clamshell seats it's um, yeah I've seen this car before South Carolina tag um, it looks okay but anyway if anybody is interested here are some phone numbers they're both Volusia County numbers and um, yeah it's a little bit of work but it looks pretty much all there so Here we have a 1974 Corvette I am pretty sure it was here last November for the uh, turkey run Thanksgiving turkey run it is automatic and uh, it's got a molded rear bumper side pipes and here we have the info 74 350 motor 35,000 miles 386 five eight nine four zero one nine eighteen thousand five hundred OBO so there you have it if you're looking for such a car here she is here we have a 1968 big block car four-speed manual transmission it is a Roadster You can see the iconic 1968 only door handles and the four brake lights. Yeah, it's a would make for a for a good project uh, vehicle. And there's no price, but the phone number is three two one five five seven eight eight nine three. So there you have it. We have a 1978 silver anniversary. Looks really, really nice. It's got side pipes. They're asking 18.5. The odometer reads 48,460. And the phone number, if anybody's interested, is 904 554 It says a run looks and sounds great. I'm sure it does. It's, uh, it's an automatic and yeah it looks pretty pretty nice actually so if anybody is interested you got the info and here we have a 1982 for sale or trade 20,000 it's got side pipes Seems to be all there. It's got aftermarket wheels. Looks pretty good. 25,000 miles, 516-993-3538. And this is a 1973 Stingray Coupe looks really really nice I noticed it's a four-speed car this car is not for sale by the way this car is here for the car show portion of the turkey uh, for the spring turkey run so it'll be here for the uh, uh, for the weekend but since it was all by itself here in this area I thought I as well shoot a quick video and included very nice sharp car 
Yeah, it's a rainy day here in Daytona Beach, but here we have what used to be a 1973 Corvette Roadster. I don't know the details. There's no price advertised, but anyway, uh, it's been highly modified. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it is what it is. It's a shame because again, a 73, I think would have a far better value than this um, Resta mod. And unfortunately, again, there's no price. And um, yeah, 73 Restomod convertible. And that's an automatic. Yeah, it's got a lot of the modern uh, seats and, and whatnot. But anyway, gosh, I thought it was going to let up, but it continues to rain this morning. So, oh well. I guess the front bumper fell off. It's got special ventilation ducts here. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. Needs a little TLC and about a hundred thousand dollars worth of parts and, and work. And this of course is a 1978 Indy Pace car, automatic. And it looks pretty, pretty good. Let's see if they have any info as far as the mileage. Okay, 78, 38,000 miles, Mike 904599, 5690, he's asking 30 grand. Overall is in pretty good condition. Let's see if I can, oh it's an L82 according to the to the badge there yeah seems to be the right mileage anyway nice little car this is a 1973 automatic matching numbers power steering 60,000 documented miles 22,800 386 237 8902 nice interior very nice very nice shape it's got the slotted rims even though they're not correct for the year they look mighty fine it's got also the luggage rack nice coupe very good condition This is a 1969 Stingray with side pipes, blue interior, 79,000 miles according to the info sheet. Appears to be very straight, very good condition overall. Little, the side pipes, a little bit rough, maybe a little bit of damage here and there, but nothing major. Really. Beautiful interior with the uh, lower bucket seats with the headrest. I like that. Here's the info sheet. Matching numbers. A four speed factory AC power steering 389-386-237-8902. Nice car. Very nice. This is a 1982 silver green on silver green Corvette and it's in beautiful condition and it looks like a new car even though it has 90,000 miles just shy of 90,000 
but it's perfectly maintained and uh, it's beautiful, beautiful condition. It's the original paint and it looks fantastic. Have a 1971 Stingray. Side pipes. Very nice chocolate brown interior. It's an automatic. Very nice shape. Seven three four two seven four two three. Matching uh, drivetrain numbers. Cold air. Seventy five thousand miles. This is the 1981 Corvette. Very nice condition. It's got a crate engine in it. And according to the info here, it's got 5,000 on crate motor, I don't know, $5,000 for 5,000K miles. I see 26,000 or trade. Seven two seven four three three seven zero seven zero. Here's some additional info. Seventy two thousand miles total. It's got black interior, four speed, eighty one Corvette. Wow, nice. Here we have a 73 Stingray and $23,000, 850-447-2497. Automatic. The clock shows 14,658 miles. Most likely 114,000 miles, yeah. That sounds about right. really sharp car and it's a convertible so even better here we have a 1982 apparently it's a stingray Very nice, clean interior. Very beautiful paint also. This is 
just here for the for the show it's not for sale that looks good in there Corvette Stingray in Briar Blue. It's been repainted, but it's the, uh, the original color. It's got vinyl interior, very good condition. 